Hey everyone, I'm Ultima456, you're the Ultimates, and welcome to episode 38 of Less Platinum Everland Legendary Edition. Alright, so I tried again, but unfortunately couldn't finish the battle. I mean, couldn't get down there, so let's go up here. Oops, I think I kind of stepped on that great. Oh dear god, this is really, really bad. Alright, so let's go with. Let's work, work this out strategically. So, first I need to heal, so. Armor of Frost. Magic heal on Koro. Okay. So we're all good health now. Now Koro needs to. Oh god, Fina. Fina! Oh god, she needs to heal herself. Koro, attack that one. Hurry up. It's so slow. Who's first? Heal on yourself. Velvet is going to use Booster on Fina. Please hit. Yeah, I'm assuming magic is just... Like it definitely goes through. Okay, now we need a little bit of confusion. Good. So if the confused ones attack each other, I think they have like a guaranteed... Or if someone who's confused attacks someone... No, let me say that again. Just give me a moment here. <laughs> if someone who has confusion is attacked, I think they have a guaranteed ch chance to... To not be confused anymore. That was not the right move to do. Booster on Kuro. Good. Fina, you can heal Kuro again. All right, we've got good, good health. Good. Uh, let's attack, I guess. Oh, how is it not dead yet? Jesus. Okay, we need an armor of frost again. So, velvet's up. Good. Fina, you gotta heal yourself. Uh, wait. Should have attacked, but that's okay. Combo. Oh my god, these, there's so many enemies and they're all very, very tough. And I didn't mean to do that, but that's okay. Come on. I'm gonna combo another one. Oh my god, are you kidding me right now? Magic confusion. Combo go. Ah, oh, wrong one. I did shouldn't have attacked that. Oh. Still worked out. That's weird. Maybe it doesn't need I don't know. Maybe it's only enemies. Hopefully oh for goodness sake. really annoying. Okay, and finish it off. Thank god. God, that took forever, man. <laughs> Hooray, we leveled up. Level 20. Alright, so... Backup genera ac generator activated. Yes, the light's back on. Alert level is now at zero. Security measures deactivating. Finally, I was getting a little sick of all that random combat. How about you, Koro? <laughs> Absolutely. That's the problem when dealing with the past. You never know how much these systems have aged. <laughs> Damn, shots fired. <laughs> all right, I can't do that. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah, that's right. Uh, earlier in the, in the game, I said that level 30 was max level. Um, I don't think that's actually true. Uh, there is a trophy for reaching level 30, but I don't think it's actually max level. I think it's possible to um, to go higher than that. Okay, nice. We got the Reno card. Reno is the um, is Menos's son, the guy we fought outside in the more Dragon Ball esque um, part of the game, and he is a seven for a five eight with trample. So he's very strong. That's actually going to be very useful to us. Um, we might be able to actually defeat some um, some card players that we couldn't beat before. Uh, already three years old. Already loves doing odd jobs with his daddy. Hmm. Already three years old. Already loves doing odd jobs with his daddy. Don't know what that one ref it's referencing. 
Access denied, level five security activated. How can that be on it? That sign looks like it's made out of paper. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. I like this part, so. Verifying request to access confinement. Initializing Turing test. Now I've heard of what a Turing test is, but I cannot remember, so the definition will be on the screen. Um, so this is cool. Um, throughout the uh, the area, you have to play some old, um, you know, really old games. <laughs> um, Pong, right, widely regarded to be the oldest game of all time. Um, I think I've mentioned before that it's it's widely regarded, but I don't think it actually is. Um, I guess I'm gonna have to do some research then in that case <laughs> and uh, see if I can figure out which one it was. But yeah, the idea is just to... Um... Oh god. The idea is just to try and uh, beat the game. So in this case, um, you have to score five. How'd you get that? Gotcha. You have to get five. Um, yeah, and you have to do this, otherwise you can't go past. Okay, ah, so close. You win. Human intelligence recognized. Is it the thing where it's like, uh, the Turing test is to decide whether you're a human or a robot? I think that's what it is. But anyway, it was on the screen, so. If I was right, then hooray. If I was wrong, then ah, oh. No. <laughs> okay, so another element, the electrified floor. The grating looks to be electrified. It might not be safe. How will we avoid getting electrocuted? We just have to wait till the energy gets weaker before stepping on it. All right, so you just got to time your attacks. Like now. Okay, good start. So just take that one out without too much effort. Music's good at least. Jesus, that guy's 20 damage to Velvet. Uh, let me actually... I'm gonna attack this time around. Because I want Fina to heal Velvet. And I want Velvet to boost... Uh, Fina, I guess. <laughs> Doesn't really matter which one. Let's... Uh, confusion... Wait. Oh, wait. Combo. Oh, nice, he died. <laughs> what on earth happened? <laughs> what was that glitch? Oh yeah, she has a ranged attack so you can attack even when the grating's electrified. I'm gonna get... Oh, nice. I went for it. <laughs> cool. Okay, uh, let's go left first. This could be heaven or this could be hell. Welcome to the... I have no idea what that's referencing. Verifying request to access confinement. Two. Initializing Turing test. Alright, we got snake. <laughs> snake is... fairly difficult. Um, the idea with snake, in order to make it easier, is just keep going in the like same direction. So for example here, I'm just literally doing circles. Um, if you want to make it like harder on yourself, you can, you know, be a little bit more risky. I'm getting very lucky with these pellet placements. Oh, awesome. Perfect. Wow, that was, if I was doing a speed run, I'd be very happy with that. <laughs> that was basically as almost as good as you can get. <laughs> um, Almost as good as you can get. It's not, but it, it was really... It was very fast. <laughs> um, okay, so I think I have no choice but to go on the thing again. God damn it. I just hate these battles. They just take too long. <laughs> Let me chop things like normal. Alright, combo. So now we've got these two enemies. Um, I'm going to try and skip um, powering up my characters because occasionally that can work. So, for example... You know, here, I didn't use any boosts or anything like that, but I was able to take out this enemy here. And we got electrified. It's fine. Okay, nice, nice. So now it's just a matter of trying to... 
take care of this guy. The only problem with him is he has... Oh, that was good damage. Nice. I think Koro can finish him now. So he's got like... If Koro finishes him, he's got a Koro... Oh, he's got a combo. Oh no. Okay, he can't. Fina, go. Seriously? Okay, he's got about two combos in him. Ow. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. Yeah, so as you play, like, you kind of try and work out how much health everything has. Verifying request to access confinement 3. What game do we have now? Ah, Space Invaders. <laughs> okay, Space Invaders. So, the way it works is you can fire one shot at a time, and every time you do, um, you can only... Uh, what do you call it? Every time you destroy an alien, um, the thing gets a little faster. So, in order to give yourself more time, you want to try and destroy the ones that are closer and I failed. Human intelligence not confirmed. <laughs> hey, that's not very nice. I said exactly what you need to do. I didn't do exactly what I needed to do, but I said it. If you miss, it takes quite a while for you to regain your shot. Oh my god, I think I'm gonna die again. Yep. Wow. Okay, let me just try and do that the way I usually do it. Which is just move all the way to the left, spam X. Move all the way to the right, spam X. <laughs> okay, not all the way, but... Okay, yeah, another way to make it easier is to... Try and, like, start on the corners and make you move your way inwards. That way when they're going super fast like this. Come on. Oh, I'm screwed, aren't I? <laughs> nope, I got it. <laughs> wow, that was a good shot. It was actually quite off, but I don't know, the game was like, nah, that's what we wanted. <laughs> Alright, cool. So we've done that. I really hope I don't miss anything here because I missed that bloody card in my um, practice playthrough and I was like trying to work out like, where the bloody hell is it? Alright, good. We don't have to deal with any lights or anything. So, you can make a decision of like... Like, for example, I, I used a combo... Oh my god, I'm... I think I did, like... I made the wrong decision. Let me try and... So, confuse... Uh, maybe that wasn't the best idea. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Armor Frost. So, you could try and, you know, set up your buffs and everything like that on your first turn. But... Um doing what I did was also not the worst thing. It's, yeah, like, I've obviously lost quite a bit of health, but it wasn't the worst decision. If I had gone for, like, another combo attack immediately after that, I think that would have been a bad idea. I'm gonna boost Kuro here, because I think he can do some good damage. And we use Fina to maybe... Uh, I was gonna say cast Confusion, but I think she's gonna need to heal herself. Yep, most definitely. Good. Luckily she can heal almost full every time. Uh, booster on Fina. Because now she needs to heal Kuro. He's taking a lot of damage. No, not on him. Heal Kuro. That one. Let's do a combo, if I can. Armor of Frost again. It's hard to tell, I don't know when... It doesn't seem to be any, any icon to let you know when... Um, I probably should have healed. There doesn't seem to be any icon to tell you whether or not you've got like Armor of Frost on. Um, oh wait, I think it's actually the blue stars on the character models. models. Get it, get it, get it. Let's combo! You're done. Alright, awesome. Almost through. We've got, I think, two more Turing tests. Can you guys come up with what the other Turing tests will be? If you guessed Pac-Man, you guessed right. Blop, 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 blop. <laughs> no joke. Gotcha. That's really annoying. Quick, quick, quick. Ah, oh. <laughs> it's like I knew it was coming to the end, but 
I thought I had like a split. I needed basically an extra second. Okay. I know. Wait, what is, what is the last Turing test? I'm trying to remember. I think there's one more. I'm just. can't quite remember what it is. <laughs> No, I can't remember what it is. <laughs> well, I was gonna say, there's one that I'm thinking of, but I'm like, positive it's not that. <laughs> I feel like Troy McClure saying, which two popular Simpsons characters has have died in the past year? If you said Bleeding Gums Mercy, Murphy and Marvin Monroe, you're wrong. They were never popular, and I can't believe I just lost that. <laughs> Oh no, <laughs> that is really annoying. You know, during all of my practices, I got all of these on the first go. <laughs> so I'm looting them all now. Oh well, at least that Space Invaders thing was cool. And yeah, I know you can use like the little doors on the sides to teleport between or from one side to the other. It's actually really clever. Oh god. Okay, so Pac Man is a little faster than the ghosts. I feel like that's the opposite in the original game. Get it, get it, get it, get it. And... Alright, well they're all on one side, so... That does help, and now they're weakened. Yay! Let's test it. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Let's test it. Dies, again. <laughs> Alright, we are almost there. Probably finish this next episode, but... Let's keep going for now. This one? This this vat has been empty for a long time. Alright, looks like I have to do one more battle. Oh, no. Yay, thank god. <laughs> I was like, I'm not really looking forward to it, but okay. Save points. Well, it's not getting around this one. Look at me, how many enemies can we fight at the same time? This is the only thing I, I dislike, is like, there's no... There's no other like elements to it, like you don't learn any more moves, you don't um, have some kind of cool triple combo with everyone, unless you do and I haven't noticed that. I have literally not tried that. What a great time to experiment. Nope. <laughs> That's fine. Uh, boost Fina quickly. She needs to heal. I think you do the combo with whoever gets the, um, whoever fills their bar first, so, yeah. So, for example, it's Kuro and Velvet right now. And I don't really see any difference as well. Where's the other one? Ah! Yeah, if you do it too early, not only do you get electrified, but you can't complete your attack. <laughs> what? Did it move the confusion to that player? I think it did. Confuse again. Grow. Get it. God oh, damn it, that electrifying thing goes too quickly. Heal Kuro. Come on. Do 75 damage. See, that's what I don't get. It's like sometimes you do a crazy amount of damage, other times not so much. Heal. But like I know, like you know, you could just say, "Oh, that's a critical hit." That's what a critical hit is, but it doesn't look like a critical hit. Like there are certain cut. Like that's not a critical hit. Wow, man, I can't believe how detailed they got that. Fina and Kuro attacked that enemy at the same time with the combo attack and only Fina took damage because she was the one that was actually like physically touching the floor I would have thought that would, that would be they would be that um, that detailed wait go no god damn it confusion <laughs> Maybe. Yay! 
Can he attack himself? I'm not going to stick around to find out, but... Oh my god. That's the thing, if you fail that, if you fail that combo attack, you lose your attack. Alright, looks like the confusion ran out. Get it, get it, get it. Okay, still not dead. It's fine. I was going to say, it gives me an opportunity to heal Kuro, but... Don't have enough mana. Wait. 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 Heal Kuro. Attack. How are you not dead yet? Oh my god, the timing. I, I can't, like... Wow, man. Alright, well, at least I finally got it. Damn, man, I'm so bad at that. Alright, cool. So let's just go down here real quick and we're going to end the episode. Um, okay, so yeah, next time we should be able to get through this area because I think we've only got like one more screen or two to go. Um, what's this here? Time flies. War is approaching fast. Find a solution. Yeah, I think this is the final... Oh, hang on. Save point. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, we'll look at that later. Um, but for now, I want to thank you all for watching episode 38 of Let's Pan Amiibo Land Legendary Edition. My name's Ultima456, you're the Ultimates, and I'll see you next time.